Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Ashwini Priya Darshan. Today's recipe is a dessert recipe which we are making with chiko fruit. It's chiko halwa. Let's see the process. For this, in a pan, I'm dry roasting two spoons of peanuts. We need to roast this in low flame for about two to three minutes. Just one or two spoons of peanuts are fine. Next, I'm taking it into a blender and making it into a fine powder. Next, in the same pan. I have added one big cup of milk. You can even use full cream or low fat. I have taken low fat milk here. Next, I am adding one cup of full ripened sapota. You can even use any kind of sapotas. Mix them well. Cook in low flame. Try to mash all the sapotas very well. They cook so fast usually. For me, it has taken around five to six minutes. Now I have added one small cardamom piece. Just one cardamom is fine. If you like more cardamom flavor, you can add more cardamom pieces. Now I'm adding roasted peanut powder. Here we are adding peanut powder to the halwa. It gives a very good texture and it adds a very nice taste as well. So it's a different thing to adding peanut powder in uh, sweets, but it is really good. You can give it a try. Next, I'm adding two spoons of milk maid. It's optional, guys. As I like the flavor and the texture which it gives, a kind of creamy texture. Hence, I'm adding two spoons of milk maid or condensed milk. Mix in low flame for about two minutes. Now, when it's boiling, I'm adding half cup of sugar. You can vary this quantity as per the quantity which you are cooking. If you are taking sapota quantity more, you can add one cup of sugar. But for me, I'm just adding half cup of sugar. Now we have to cook this for another five to six minutes in medium or low flame. Once it changes color, I'm adding roasted dry fruits. I have roasted these dry fruits in ghee. I've taken cashews, almonds, and kismis, both black and brown colors. Now cook for another two minutes. That's it. This is the desired consistency which we are looking for. If you want it more thick, you can cook for another two to three minutes. So that's it, guys. This is an easy and different recipe. Must try recipe, I must say. And it doesn't even take so much of your time. If you like this video, press the like button. Do share your feedbacks in the comment section, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.